With Lightroom CC, we can take our landscape photography to the next level. Here's a photo from pro photographer Chris Burkhart capturing this amazing scene in New Zealand. However, this image is right out of the camera as a camera raw file. What I'm going to do is simply start with a better starting point. I'm going to go to Profile and I'm going to switch from Adobe Color or Adobe Standard to Adobe Landscape and that already starts to bring out the colors in this photo. Next, we're going to go to the light panel where I have the AI based auto tone button. While I can move all the sliders manually, just simply clicking auto tone will detect the image and use machine learning and AI based controls to give me a better starting point. Now, I may not agree with all of them. So for example, I'm just going to bump up the contrast just a bit more. And I'm also going to bring the highlights down a bit more to bring out a little bit more detail in those clouds. Next up, I'll head down to the effects panel where I have the ability to apply a bit more clarity and a bit of dehaze to the photo. Last but not least, I noticed that the horizon isn't perfectly straight, but we can fix that by simply going to the crop tool and clicking auto. And if that's not getting it just the way you want, you can still rotate the image, which brings up an automatic grid to where you can align the image and get it just the way you want. Now, last but not least, I noticed that the sky can come out a little bit more. So let's go into our linear gradient where I brought the temperature down a little bit. I've also brought the exposure down a little bit. I've added a, just a tad bit more dehaze and a tad bit more saturation. So I'm just gonna go up to the upper left corner and pull in diagonally to bring in my linear gradient to make the sky really pop. So now we've gone from out of the camera to our finished photo here in Lightroom CC with just a few simple clicks.